Hello YouTube Boss Rino, welcome to my channel sa ito. Ay nako, malapit na mag-undas. Oo, kaya ito na ang next top 5 sigurado malapit ang entry nito. Top 5, uh, top 10 scary ghost video to freak you out. So, hahatiin ko lang ulit ha, kasi 30 minutes eh. So, alam niyo naman, uh, sasakit ang leg ko. <laughs> oh, hahatiin ko na para dalawang video din at para, di ba, hindi masyado mahaba. So, ito, nakita niyo ba yung damit ko? Sobrang ganda. Mm -hmm. Sobrang ganda. Ito ay mabibili nyo sa The Rookies Clothing. So, lalagay ko sa description sa baba yung, uh, tawag dito, uh, link nila kung saan nyo siya pwedeng makontak at para maka-order kayo. Okay, so papakita ko pala sa inyo. Tatayo ako. O, oh, diba? Para akong model. <laughs> Feeling model si Boss Rino. Tapos, uh, tawag dito. Sobrang ganda ng tela. I love it. Oo, sobrang ganda. Saktong-sakto sa akin. Ang ganda ng tela. Ang gusto ko sa kanila, sobrang ganda ng print. Grabe. So, tirahin na dito bago pa tirahin na iba. Ron, naman. Anonymous TikTok user BB11 says that for the last two years, he's been dealing with unnerving paranormal activity in his home in Texas. He says that it's gotten so bad that he can't sleep without the lights on. So, one night one of his friends is sleeping over when BV11 begins to hear strange sounds coming from his bedroom closet. Oh, she. Ayoko na mga ganito, yung mga dimang ilaw. Uy, gago. Hey, get up. Get up, get up. You here, listen. Sleep. Uy, ano yun? Lalo ko nakatayo. Gago kayo. I'm f***ing getting in this room. I can't sleep in here. This sh**. BB11 wakes up his friend and opens the closet door only to find nothing inside. Now his friend is actually skeptical and really just seems to be very annoyed by the whole ordeal. But either way, TikTok user BB11 makes it his mission to record evidence of his terrifying experiences. Late one night, when he's all alone, he hears sounds coming from the hallway just outside his bedroom. He quickly grabs his phone and begins to record. What happens next is downright chilling. Okay, guys, I think this might be the last time. Oh, da dan da dan da dan da dan da dan. A strange, bizarrely oh, shaped dark figure charges toward him and he quickly slams his door shut. But what do you think this could be? Parang ano, ma malugo ang buhok, tapos parang walang damit, no? Nakanood siya. Ew. Is BV11's home haunted? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Merton Pryor. Ayaw ko nang ganun, no? Pag yung magbubukas ako ng pinto, ah, uh, Talagang kailangan muna abutin ko yung ilaw bago ko tumingin dun sa kwarto. <laughs> ilaw muna. <laughs> Paranormal investigators Jeff, Phil, and Mark from the YouTube channel Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations are invited to spend the night at the 900-year-old ruins of the haunted Merton Priory Chapter House in London, England. From the years 1114 to 1538, the Chapter House was a meeting room and part of a gigantic cathedral that no longer exists today. Museum trustee John Hawks believes that a presence haunts the ancient ruins. Um, I'd, I've always felt that there was a presence here. There was an extraordinary atmosphere. We may be under a road on slabs of concrete, but, but I, I think that the, the, the kind of spirit we have here is a very benign one. In this room, in the chapter house, yeah, I mean, you're familiar with going into large churches and finding graves under Ito na parang narrator ng ano eh, parang siya narrator ng pelikula yun, ang ganda ng boss no? the floor. Yeah. In this room, there were 31 graves under the floor. Wow, 31 graves? were dug up. As the trustee mentions, the ruins were excavated in the late 1980s, 
and 31 bodies were found buried under the floor. The bodies are believed to be the remains of monks from the cathedral, and it is thought that many passed away from the plague. That night, the Ghost Tech team sets up their static cameras and begin their investigation. Jeff sits on the floor asking questions of the alleged spirit, and then things take a terrifying turn. If there's something that you can do to let us know that you can hear my voice, please move something, even throw something at me, I don't mind. At least I know that you're here and that you're listening. Now I guess I must be sitting on top of where lots of the skeletons were found. Can you come and take a seat next to me? Oh, 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 damn it, oh, 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 I felt the floor move behind me and I heard footsteps right up behind me. Can you come and take a seat next to me? When we review the footage and audio, the footsteps are louder on Static Cam 1. Here is the audio taken from Static Cam 1. Grabe, ang bigat ng paa ng multo. Hi there. I heard you. Sorry, you made me jump. Jeff jumps up in shock as he feels movement on the floorboards and hears footsteps right behind him. Now, Jeff is normally very calm and composed during their investigations. But he freaks right out and even drops his recorder to the floor and almost breaks it as he jumps to his feet. However, the Ghost Tech team has no idea that they captured something even more shocking. A static camera recording the ruins where the 31 bodies were found captures something truly eerie. Patay. May kaluluwa na naman eh, oh. A dark figure seems to walk from the preserved coffins on display against the back wall and simply disappears into thin air. The Ghost Tech team has no explanation for what they captured and they believe that they might have recorded paranormal evidence of the spirit that is said to haunt the Chapter House Museum. You can watch this entire investigation and many more spooky moments over on the YouTube channel, Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations. You know what I'm afraid of the reaction of Kuya? Yes, I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid of it. If you found a great ghost video online or recorded one yourself, please send it my way. And now, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find a source for this next video, but from what I have gathered, the footage was captured by security cameras at an abandoned pachinko arcade in Nogano, Japan. It is said that the ghost of a young girl is often seen inside this abandoned arcade. The CCTV footage seems to show a policeman investigating after an alarm in the abandoned arcade was set off. I... something. What happens next is downright chilling. Ito, kasino daw, no? Oh, Chang, yun, nakatakot to. Oh, yun yun. Tangin na biglang nabala. What looks like the figure of a young girl can be seen following the policeman. But he doesn't see or hear anything. When the policeman turns to leave, the girl can be seen suddenly crouching oh! nearby. Now because there's no source, we'll probably just never know what happened. 
So, the footage remains unexplained. My Haunted Hotel So you yeah, know, no, yo, oy, my haunted recall hotel. from our previous story on Nuke's Top 5 that at the allegedly very haunted Ye Old King's Head Inn in Chester, England, the owner, along with his two friends, actually allow curious ghost seekers to spend the night at the 400-year-old inn and investigate the paranormal activity for themselves. And the guests usually find something spooky. It's all captured by their 16 CCTV cameras and posted to their YouTube channel, My Haunted Hotel. Well, since our last update, some new spooky incidents have been caught on camera at the hotel. Of course, there are the usual hotel guests who come in as skeptics with a bit of an attitude. Someone can have right there, actually. Oh, Katie. No, look at her. She did it. We did it! Oh, no, <laughs> it's not funny, Katie. This is the dog. Why are you carrying it? For? Oh, she's got to bear outside to the back, Katie. <laughs> but then, when something invisible pounds on your door, it's likely to change your skeptical mind. But it could be laughter. <laughs> the children are. Is there a child? Are you outside that door? Whoa! That's gotta be the door. That is the, is the door. Oh my god. You outside that door? Ah! 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 But they have caught some other chilling evidence that even freaks out the My Haunted Hotel team. In this clip, the team is gathered in the restaurant of the hotel with a group of guests when they experience something that shocks them all. I need to hear you, Charles. I need to know who you are. Is your surname Griffith? Whoa! The second piece of evidence is just as astonishing as the first, and we are able to document this moment from four different cameras, which clearly capture what we deem to be poltergeist activity, as a glass is flung from the function room bar. I need to know who you are. Is your surname Griffith? Is your surname Griffith? Is your surname Griffith? I didn't even get on to the fact that there were glasses on the bar, so when something made a noise, I thought something had just moved behind this bar until Phoebe screamed in my face that it was the glass. <laughs> Look, th there is no way. It, it flings back this way. Like, th there's just no way. But that's not all that they've captured at the inn over the last month. In the middle of the day, a security camera in the hallway outside room five captures something the My Haunted Hotel team just can't explain. A shadow figure seems to just materialize at the end of the hallway and then quickly disappears. Hindi to hindi natin siya dumakita eh no. Eh, lalo pag uh, sa, sa paligid lang natin, talaga hindi natin makikita kung ganyan na parang parang usok na itim lang na manipis na manipis, hindi natin makikita eh no. Harry, oh. Brent and Danny are shocked and thrilled by what their security camera caught on video. The team says that they've always hoped to capture a full-bodied apparition on video in the hotel. So, to watch many more spooky incidents that the team and hotel guests experience within Ye Old King's Head Inn, you can go to the YouTube channel my Haunted Hotel. Beware the purple chair.
Ito, last one na to, ha? Mother Martina claims that she and her family Ayan, ayoko na may bata! ...family are terrorized by a dark supernatural entity that haunts their home. Martina has set up a series of static cameras to keep a safe watch on her children. But she also caught some footage that is absolutely unnerving. Uy, kakakita ko lang ito, ha? Oo, oh, kakakita ko lang ito. Ito yung nakita ko doon sa Vietnamese, tinranslate ko na ito eh. Hindi ko talaga alam pa paano lumurong yan eh, ang galing eh. Two doors move by themselves and the boy calls for his mother, but otherwise doesn't seem that concerned. But as he continues to play his video game, his chair is forcefully pushed backwards, finally sending the boy running from mama. Cut to another day and Martina is casually vacuuming the hallway carpet. Then, this happens. Ito medyo kompleto dito. O, tami na yun! Bumalik yung buhay! Wow! Gago! Tang ulo, hayop yun ah. Again, a door moves by itself and Martina's vacuum seems to float into the air as she hysterically slaps and screams at it until it just drops back to the ground. But the creepy activity doesn't stop there. Martina and her son are home alone one night when the living room security camera captures this. Puta, meron pa rin. Ah, ito pala yun. The outside door opens and closes on its own as the door handle rapidly rotates as if being turned by some invisible force. Martina grabs her phone and is about to record the door when the purple desk chair suddenly glides toward her and her son. The two have had enough and are about to hurry out of the living room but something seems to forcefully pull at Martina's sweater. So is this real poltergeist activity caught on camera? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? Di ba sumabit lang yung, yung damit niya, nakuha yung sinulid? You yung parang, decide. Parang ganun, di ba? Passing through. Woo! Grabe. O, tutuloy ka sa next video yung pie ba? Kasi nangangawit na ako eh. <laughs> 15, 15 minutes lang tayo. Actually, 18 minutes na sa akin. Sobrang tagal na, di ba? Para may break din kayo. Umihi muna kayo. Mm -hmm. Tapos balikan nyo yung susunod na video ko. <laughs> so, yan. Maraming maraming salamat sa panunod. At hanggang sa mga.